tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Well, Black and White Sports 2 fans, you guys may know that uh, Dan Snyder, the owner of the Washington Commanders slash Redskins, is actually looking to probably sell uh, the franchise. Now, he's on the um, the Commanders slash uh, Redskins for, I believe, roughly about two decades now. And he bought the franchise for eight hundred million dollars. Now, guys, we pretty much have an estimate as to what will be the selling price or at least what's being asked for the purchase of the franchise. And guys, I got to say, this is very, very good news if you are Jerry Jones of the Dallas Cowboys. Now, the Denver Broncos, when they sold on recently, it went for just under $5 billion. I believe it was something like um, $4.65 billion. Now, Dan Snyder, I don't believe initially he actually wanted to sell, but um, the word is behind the scenes owners are pressuring him to sell the franchise. Uh, the other other NFL owners, they don't want him around. And there's a lot of uh, uh, stuff going on with the uh, commanders. Even Washington is actually getting involved, investigating them. It looks pretty bad. But uh, check this out. Over here on Larry Brown Sports. Report reveals possible commander sale price. If Daniel Snyder does sell the Washington Commanders, he is in line for a massive return on his original investment. Jay Glazer of Fox Sports reported Sunday that there is hope the Commanders could be sold within the next six months or thereabouts. According to Glazer, the franchise will likely cost somewhere around seven billion dollars. $7 billion on the open market. Now, you can see here, here's a tweet. The asking price for the Washington Commanders is expected to go for about $7 billion. According to Jay Glazer, the hope is for something to get done within the next six months. Uh, the Broncos recently sold for a record $4.65 billion. Washington could go uh, for way, way more. Now, I completely agree with this. And it does say here that he did buy the franchise in 1999. So that was uh, 23 years ago. For eight hundred million dollars. That is going to be a massive, massive return on his investment. Now, Jerry Jones. Jerry Jones bought the Cowboys in uh, what, 1989. And he also um, fired um, the legendary Tom Landry. Uh, he bought it for what, like 80 something million, if I'm not mistaken. Now, folks, the Dallas Cowboys are the number one sports franchise in the world, not just the NFL, but in the world. Now, Jerry Jones said um, a little while ago, if he actually decided to sell the Cowboys, that the Dallas Cowboys would actually go for something like 10 billion dollars. I believe he's probably wrong now. I believe if the commanders actually do go for seven billion and it actually may go for a little bit more than that. If Jerry Jones were to actually decide to sell the Cowboys right now, I'm willing to bet it'll probably be something like it'll probably sell for like a 12 billion, 12 billion, because that is the power of the Cowboys. Now, the Washington Redskins were a very, very famous uh, franchise. Now they changed the name. Technically, it's still the same team, but I believe, you know, a lot of uh, what made the Redskins, the Redskins was the name, uh, the logo, but now it's the Commanders. It's a dumb name. I don't like it at all. Um, the Dallas Cowboys, this is a good day for Jerry Jones. Jerry Jones, if he sold this team right now, I believe would definitely command something like $12 billion billion. And it's only going to grow. Now, his $10 million estimate, I believe that was um, a while back. Uh, right now, we're in a time of inflation. So the price is just going to keep going up. The Dallas Cowboys have a massive, massive, very, very strong brand here in the United States of America. Also around the world. The NFL is the number one 
sports franchise, sports um, league, I should say, in America. But if Daniel Snyder sells this team for $7 billion, Jerry Jones has to be sitting back and smiling, saying, man, my team would probably actually go for $12 billion. That's just my estimate. You know, I'm not an expert in any of this, but I believe that um, rich people would actually overpay probably even a little bit more just to get the Cowboys because it's the Cowboys. They they would be able to make a whole bunch of money off the Cowboys. Now, Jerry Jones has no desire whatsoever to sell his team. I believe Jerry Jones will never, ever sell the team. I believe he's just going to own the team till he dies. And then it's going to go to his son, uh, Stephen Jones, to run uh, the day to day operations on the team. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports, two fans, the Washington Commanders, Redskins, going for seven billion dollars. That's probably about right. Maybe eight. I was actually thinking eight because I think I actually mentioned in a video on the main sports channel, I believe. I think I said eight billion. Seven billion, still roughly in the same ballpark. But anyway, guys, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.